two kind of breeds for this. One yeah. is like the standalone event app. So for example, I worked on CES, the Consumer Electronics Show, and I managed the mobile app um, project there. And so we built that. We used EventBase as a partner to make that happen. Not a, anybody that downloads the app can see that. And so EventBase, they are an mobile event app company. That is all they right. do. And anybody can talk, contract with them to configure their app using their product, you know? And then there's other like more SaaS products, like a, like a, a Swoohoo or Jiffle Now. There's a whole bunch of, whole bunch of like SaaS products, which is the whole kit and caboodle from registration to the session management, to the digital venue, to the expo portal. That also includes a mobile app and your specific event kind of lives in what's called a container app. And so yeah, I've okay. worked on Swoohoo events. And so you download the Swoogle app and then there is your event wrapped in the Swoogle app. And then kind of, but the, like the new trend that's starting to happen and that we're seeing a lot more is what's called progressive web apps, which is really this idea that you get rid of the quote unquote old school, like downloadable app. And it really is almost like a, just a wrapper and a super responsive website that comes with its own sets of challenges around connectivity. We talked about Wi-Fi, you know, and stuff yeah. like that earlier. So making sure that that's going to be appropriately responsive is a, is a separate challenge in and of itself. 